I'm just saying my piece and welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me today. We're talking about snow Mageddon, and this is the massive snowstorm of 2022, the biggest snowstorm in Toronto that we have had in, in fact, the biggest snowstorm we have had in a very long time in Ontario. And uh, this is, I am passing 401, and this is what 401 looks like. what 401 looks like sorry guys it is difficult i am trying to walk through five feet of snow here so you can you'll have to give me a minute uh, all right all right ah wait a minute ah just a second yeah okay sorry guys ah now i am literally standing on top of the, the bridge here uh, done Dan Mills and 401 and this is what the 401 looks like it's complete chaos these what you're looking at here are vehicles that are trying to take the exit of 401 to get out to Shepherd and well essentially they're trying to get off at Leslie um, and that will take them on to Shepherd. But the problem with that is that Shepherd is completely blocked. And as you can see, there are very few, few people, vehicles going westward on the 401, except for those that are trying to exit. Because the 401 down there is completely blocked off. Now, it was cloud earlier today, but as you can see, just a second, my knees are freezing, my legs are freezing. Let me just show you where I'm standing here. That is up to my thigh in snow right now. So guys, this is a very, very serious situation. Now those are vehicles over on that side there that are going east. And as you can see, it is essentially just a parking lot. Nothing is moving. Big trucks are just hanging out. Everybody is just taking a break. All you can see going westward is tail light after tail light after tail light. Uh, this is the biggest snowstorm we have had for years. And the biggest snowstorm of 2022, guys. So, thanks for joining me. And I'll be back in a few minutes. I'll show you what is going on on the other side of this bridge because it is phenomenal, guys. I'm going to try to cross right here. Hopefully, I don't get knocked over. And of course, this being Canada, people just simply just go about their business. And that's going to be it. <laughs> Everyone is just enjoying the snow right here, guys. And this being Canada, the only thing we say is welcome to Canada, right? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's see what's around here. All right. Oh. So, guys, I am on the other side. And over here is just as bad. Technically, right here is about four feet. I'm going to try to see if I can make it over there. But honestly, it looks like a parking lot. So, I'm going to try stepping into it. Ah, here we are. Ah, it is genuinely snowmageddon. Can you see that, guys? Here is a snowplow doing its thing. And uh, I should tell you now, this, this year looking at on this side right here, this is the exit of the 404. This is the exit from the 404. And you can see cars are simply just parked there. There is, in fact, they're all shut off. 
some of them actually more than likely have run out of gas i was at the gas station just now and there were people with gas cans just trying to get gas so it is um shall we say interesting so, let's just look at the plow doing its thing again because it's going to come down and try to give it another hit it's clearing up but the fact of the matter is that even if it does clear there is nowhere to go because the roads are completely congested it's a simply bumper to bumper traffic there is absolutely nowhere to go whatsoever and this is shall we say interesting now watch let's try to see what the plow is gonna hit as it comes back down here again um well when i say hit i mean you know how it's gonna run um by the way the fumes from all the idling cars here is just unbelievable i can barely catch my breath with all the fumes from all of these cars that are simply just sitting here idling and because i'm at the top of the bridge i think the bridge is around 40 feet up 30 30 yeah about 30 feet up um it's just accumulated up here and it's unbelievable so, as you can see over here we have a truck that needs a little bit of attention and we have mr classic towing there doing his thing so let's see what's going to happen here it would appear as if he can't manage but we don't know what's going on yet but if you're a tow truck operator i can tell you one thing you are having a blast today you are going to earn your pay so let's see what's going to happen so this is just saying my piece thank you for joining me and i will be bringing you more and more of this snowmageddon as the day unfolds guys so um this is again this is the 401 uh where the dawn builds bridge intersects the 401 so thank you very much and you all have a great day